Hello YouTube, this is Flots45. I had a quick review on something. So if anybody is thinking of buying these knee power knee stabilizers from the from the company uh, Uplift, I just had a quick review on it. Um, for starters, um, sorry, I'm in a messy garage. This is how my product showed up which I'm not really saying anything about their company. Um, more likely that's all uh, post office kind of a deal there. Um, but, so I got them out. So here's what they look like. It'd be a little hard with the holding the phone here, but all right, that's what they look like. Okay, um, so when you're watching the uplift commercial they have like the little badges right here that are so you know that, that look neat and they say knee power knee you know and all that on them so it's usually on both the ends when I was watching them and so I got these and this this all here is ABS plastic which that's not that's not bad ABS is pretty good it does come with a package here with some more springs in here because I'm imagining these break, these springs, um, they go up inside the this hole here in the ABS. The problem I noticed, let's see if I can do this here, is that okay, that's that's tension on it right there, okay. But with how big how big this is in here compared to the little spring um, strut running off the spring, which is you know. That's about the size of a G string on a, on a guitar, and this is a lot bigger in here. I'm not going to be able to show you, but well, kind of. See how it's sitting in there, and there's a lot of room. So you you go all the way to here, all the way to there, before there is any tension whatsoever. It's just it's just nothing all the way to there. Now there's some tension right here, but it's. I mean, your leg is almost you know, at, at 90 before you actually really get any, anything. I, I did put, I did put them on. Actually, I bought these for my wife. She's a stroke survivor. And uh, she had a stroke a couple of years ago and her left side of her, her bot, you know, her left side got a little messed up. And, and so she kind of wears a brace on her left leg. And um, I thought these would be perfect for her, you know, to help her to walk and, and, you know, just just help her a little bit, uh, regain some muscle in her left leg. But you know, after putting these on myself, these aren't going to help her at all. And I'm not saying that they're designed for somebody that's had a stroke, but in their info commercial, what they describe that these are supposed to do for your legs is exactly perfect for someone that suffered a stroke and that's having uh, you know an issue with one of their legs. And I gotta say, man, these things are garbage. Um, <laughs> for starters, the, the Velcro, this is all the Velcro you get. That small little tab. When you put this, when I, when I put them on my, my legs, I, you know, I'm, not, I'm not a fat dude, but you know, pretty good sized up here. I put them around and I don't know, I, it's hard to explain how that little that little thing once i did bend down i can hear this thing you know coming off of the the, the rest of the velcro or i'm you know off of the other part over here and i can i can see where this you use that a few times anybody that's familiar with velcro you know it, it it doesn't last forever but i mean this whole thing here should be you know the whole thing should be the really stiff plasticky type velcro this is like the real cheap shit that you that you buy, or, you know, that you get on on crappy little kid toys. It's not that really stiff, you know, thick bristled uh, Velcro. Um, and other than the box being a wreck, it comes in this, and these are. This gives you like what you're supposed to do, and it's on this 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 thing here. And it's not actually something that you can reach in here. I was trying to take this out. It's actually like 
it's stuck in there. You can't you can't get it out. It's almost like a some sort of a screen print sticker, vinyl sticker that's in there, and it doesn't come out. So not that you know, it's not rocket science on how to put them on, but I would say definitely. There's nothing on YouTube that you can find, I don't, at least not that I can find, to review these. There is stuff, a lot of stuff on YouTube, but it's all from the damn companies. They're putting their own reviews up there, which is total horse shit. Um, I wouldn't buy these guys. Um, it's one of uh, China's best here, made in China. And I'm not, I'm not putting everything down that's made in China. We all have tons of stuff that's made in China, but these are garbage, man. They, don't, they do not freaking work. You know, they show in the commercial how it's helping the old people, you know, walk upstairs and shit. And it, no way. No way. Not when you can actually, again, this is on your leg. You're going to go all the way to there, which is, that's pretty, it's getting close to being a 90 before you get any tension. And the tension that you get, it's nothing. I mean, I'm having, it looks like there is some, I mean, there is some, don't get me wrong. But. The reason why there's no tension all the way up into there, it's because of how big they made these pockets in here for that little spring strut to go in there. It just, it flops up and down like this before it gets any tension. You know, you might be able to shove something into those holes and actually, uh, you know, increase to where you'd get better tension. Excuse me for a second, I've got a... What's the matter, buddy? Are you stuck under here? Come on, come on. My puppy went under the car. He's whining. I think his lead was stuck on the tire. Sorry about that. Anyway, yeah, like I said, maybe if you could find something and, and jam it up in there and you'll be able to get, you know, full tension right off the get-go. But if not, like I said, that's how, that's how much is just is garbage. So these things, they're not gonna last long. That's why they give you the, the little package here. Of, I think there's, looks like there's three springs in here. Or, yeah, there's only three. One, two, three, no, there's four. So evidently the springs break. Once you can tell you can replace them, you just, you just back that out of there and replace the springs. But I think the Velcro is gonna wear down long before that. And another thing, they show people running and exercising in these things, they're freaking hot. My legs start, you know, I live in Seattle, Washington. It's a good balmy ass, uh, I don't know, 88 today, which is pretty warm. But there's no way you're going to want these on your, your bare legs. You're going to have to wear jeans with them or something. I mean, they're, they're so uncomfortable. I mean, they're just, there's, and here's the back of it. You can feel the ABS here. And I don't think they even deburred the sides of the ABS before they slid them in these pouches, which... You could probably take them out yourself and deburr it. You know, probably put a bull nose going down these so it's not so damn sharp back here. But I don't think if you do, see, it almost looks, it's even a bad stitch. See, these are just made shitty. I'm not sure, it took a long time to get these two. I think it took almost a month. I believe I paid 75, 80 bucks for them. Total waste of my money, man. Total waste. Oh yeah, and you do also get this this nice um, bag here that you can put them in, which kind of feels like it's a um, it's a plastic vinyl kind of a bag, which will probably last I don't know maybe a couple of months. It's going right in the garbage can. Anyway, YouTubers do not buy this shit. Um, I hope anybody that's going to buy it actually tries to find a review on YouTube and actually finds mine. Um, they're not worth, they're, they do not do what they say they do at, at all in that commercial, man. The ones you see in that commercial, I said, they're not what you get. Those ones they showed there, man, those things, somebody, those are made a little different. Let's just put it that way. And then they, they marketed their info commercial and made this garbage, you know? So I don't know. Anyway, I hope somebody sees this, uh, Seize this before they actually purchase them, especially if they're purchasing them for a loved one, you know, that actually really needs them. Um, they don't go on you like that either, just to let you know. Um, those were, that's not what they, they, they look like when they're on you. Um, 
these uh, wraps here. Like I said, I've got pretty good size upper thigh and, and they're long enough. I'll give them that credit for that, but just that little bit of uh, Velcro right there. You try to do this, or you do this, shit, you're gonna hear that Velcro starting to peel off there. It, no, don't buy them, okay? All right, I hope, I hope this helps somebody, saves them a little bit of money and the, the long, painful um, shipping. All right, thanks for watching later, bye.